This past October, every student at Hart High School was given a laptop computer and an email address. We had gone into it from an educational perspective. We had wanted to get our high school to be more of a 21st century learning environment. When he found out that someone had broken into the high school this past week, Superintendent Platt and the district's technology director came to a realization. While they didn't recognize the three people caught on the school surveillance cameras, maybe someone else within the district would. We had the video, we had the still shots that we used off from the, you know, from the camera systems, and it was a point of, you know, we'll send it out to staff and see if we recognize kids, and then we kind of thought, well, we got the ability to send it out to everyone that's part of our email addresses and anybody knows who the kids are, it's probably going to be the kids themselves. They emailed photos to everyone in the district. They also posted some of the surveillance video to social media. And within minutes, and that might be an overstatement, it might be within seconds, we started to get responses uh, from people. The district gave those tips to police. The police also showed some of that surveillance footage to other students. And it wasn't long before investigators had three names to go with the three people in the video. It's, it's very satisfying because then, you know, the, the hard work of, you know, the tech department does of making sure everything is up and running actually pays off and it's used. So it's very satisfying. In Oceana County, Tom Kramer, ABC 29 and 8.